What's up, my YouTube friends? How y'all doing? I hope y'all all having a blessed day. Welcome or welcome back to another video. Thank you so much for tuning in. My name is Momo, and I love to do nails. Anything that's nail related, I love to do. So if those are the type of videos you like to watch, honey, well, guess what? You are in the right channel. So hit that subscribe button for me, right? And the notification bell right next to it on to all. So that you get notified for when I upload again and become my YouTube friend. I would really, really, really love to have you as my YouTube friend. And not only that, y'all. I'm on the roll, y'all, to 1K subscribers. <clears throat> My bad. I'm on the roll, y'all, to 1K subscribers. So, if you can help me by getting there, if you can help me get there by hitting that subscribe button, I would really, really, really appreciate it. It would really, really, really mean a lot to me if you do so. So, if you keep coming back, right, and you didn't hit that subscribe button yet, hello, like, hello, you keep coming back, so do me that favor and hit that subscribe button for me and help me get to 1,000 subscribers, y'all. Anyway, y'all, so with that being said, let's get right into this video. As y'all can see, that I already started to prep all the nail beds with a sanding band, pushing back the cuticles and all that good stuff with the sanding band, you know, taking away any, you know, cuticles that stuck around the cuticle area with the sanding band and also pushing it back at the same time with the sanding band. I'm using a medium grit sanding band. Then I'm going in with a small cuticle ball bit just to go around the area, around the cuticle area, you know, a little bit more just to clean up around it to make it look more clean and decent, okay? In today's video, y'all, I am doing my sister's nails and I'm using the Nail Mate um, acrylic powders from Glitter Planet UK glitterplanetuk.com i will leave the website down below if you're interested in those acrylic very very banging acrylics y'all so and i you know i did say that i was going to use three um acrylics that i got from the mystery box in today's videos okay so stay tuned and continue watching as i finish up prepping up the nail beds so i could put on the nail tips and all that good stuff okay um then i'm gonna use a um, cuticle scissors y'all i'm gonna use some cuticle scissors to try to to cut some cuticles that's lifted on my sister's nails y'all but i feel like it really didn't do anything because it felt like i wasn't cutting shit y'all <laughs> it felt like i wasn't cutting shit then i was nervous cutting it and the video is gonna look like i wasn't nervous because it is speed up but i was nervous and i should have just went in with a bigger ball bit just to you know take away any dead skins that was lifted i could have went in with a bigger ball bit but oh well so yeah y'all um do y'all notice the video a little bit different uh the clarity of the video do y'all notice it a little bit different than the other videos or y'all don't notice the difference at all if so leave me let me know in the comments down below if you notice the difference of the 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 quality of the video the clarity you know you know you know what i mean All right, y'all, so I'm going to go in with Lissette Gen Nails, the little tips. I've been having these tips for a while now. And for some reason, it was giving me a little hard trouble to adhere these nail tips. I know it happened to me before with some other nail tips where it gives me, like, little problem to adhere. Did that ever happen to y'all with certain nail tips? Yeah, because it was happening to me with this one. And I never noticed that happening to me with, with these particular nail tips before i know it happened to me with other notes but not with this one i had to have to tell my sister to help me with the dance spray and that dance spray stink that glue dryer spray that shit smell that roast spray <laughs> that shit stink well anyway i had to use that so these tips can adhere faster or whatever or better faster whatever so and then i'm using the young nails glue to do that and i don't know maybe it's because of the glue maybe it's getting a little old on me or something i don't know because i did have that glue for a while and it's brand new y'all Now I'm going to use a 150 medium grit sanding band to uh, blend in the nail tips to the nail beds. Thank you. 
all right y'all now that i got her nails all nice and prepped and reshaped and all that good stuff um the bitch is looking at her nails like um do i want them shorter or what and i'm like no you ain't getting them any shorter i don't like doing short nails you know that shit gonna stay like that bitch <laughs> she said no i know i'm not, I'm not i don't want it short i want it like, that's okay like this and there y'all know it's gonna stay like that so anyway i'm using perfect pink teal dreamy and mint ninja from the nail make acrylic powders from glitter planet uk y'all check those glitter i mean check those acrylics out y'all they are banging 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 now i'm using uh natalie carmona's nc's dehydrator and primer i'm putting on the dehydrator now and then i'm gonna go ahead and put on the primer and then i will be going in with the very thin layer of clear acrylic onto all the nails so like that just in case you know to protect the primer y'all because these bitches do not know how to stay still like they's always touching something grabbing something their phone going in their pockets and all that stuff so i gotta tell them i got you got primers on your nails do not touch anything y'all gonna get lint on it y'all gonna do this y'all gonna fuck up the adhesion to the acrylic what that means but why but why you gotta put a clear layer for a clear layer for what that does and this and that and that in the third like mm, and they shut the fuck up shut the fuck up <laughs> and listen to what i gotta say anyway so that's why i go in with the clear acrylic. a lot of people do it to protect the natural nail paste from the color of the acrylic and which is you know yeah that's fine too i also do that too if i'm using really really pigmented pigmented colors then yeah i would recommend to do that but i really really do this y'all so like that if they gotta go in their pockets they gotta scratch their head or they gotta grab their phone or something at least the primer is protected from you know it's protected it got a clear a thin clear layer of acrylic onto all the nail bits so just in case they gotta go touch something you know it won't bother the primer you know but every time i do this y'all their nails last like really really long when i do this step and and they barely get any lifting that's why i also like to do this step all right y'all now um i'm going in with perfect pink and i'm apply that to the pinky and if you notice that the mod the, the powder is drying up super fast on me y'all that is because it was this acrylic powder was drying pretty fast on me and i am using on that dish y'all i am using two guys monomer so when i noticed that the acrylic was drying super fast on me like that i thought it was the monomer and i went ahead and switched up on the monomer um to natalie carmona's monomer but once i started to use once i switched up the monomer y'all um it was still doing the same thing to me the acrylic was still drying pretty fast on me so it wasn't the monomer y'all uh to me i think it was the acrylic it was drying you know super fast on me because of the weather you know what i'm trying to so you know um in my last videos i did was saying something about monomers and you know to try different monomers if you see your acrylics drying super fast on you and stuff like that y'all which yeah it can be like it can be the monomer y'all at the end of the day not every monomer pairs with certain powders if you get what i'm trying to say not every monomer pairs with certain powders so i would recommend to try different monomers with different powders to see which one works best for you and i also did say to try to work with uh, monomers that are universal you, you know what I, you get what i'm trying to say uh because there are there are monomers out there that are you know that are universal and they compare with any powders like Mia Secret is one of them. I think Mia Secret is one of them. Young Nails is one of them. Not Polish, I think is one of them. They, you, you know, it doesn't matter what what powder you use, it it'll still work good with you know with those powders. But yeah, y'all. Um, like I said, I thought it was the monomer, and it wasn't. It was the powder, and because of the weather also, you know. And then covered acrylics, y'all. They tend to dry up faster now in the summer. So I wouldn't sit there and wait for the bee to polymerize or anything like that. Me, I'm talking about me. I wouldn't do that because like I tried to do that here and I didn't even have enough time to maneuver that damn bead. 
when I applied it onto the nails, it just still stuck like right there. So what I started to do was like, okay, since this powder is drying super fast on me, it's not the monomer that's making it dry fast. So, I, you know, it's gotta be the weather now, you know, because it's warmer. So what I'm gonna do is pick smaller beads. Don't let it polymerize, like, cause I don't have enough time for it to polymerize because you know, it's gonna dry up super fast on me. So what I did was just started to pick up smaller beads, place it on the nails and maneuver the acrylic like that, you know, with small beads at a time. You get what I'm trying to say? So try, try like that. If you're a beginner and if you're noticing your covered acrylic is drying super fast on you and you're trying it with different monomers and stuff like that, try with smaller beads, y'all. And don't, and try not to let the bead sit in on your brush waiting for it to polymerize. You get what I'm trying to say? No, try not to do that. You know, just place it on the nails and work with it. I mean, if you could wait for like one or two seconds, then yeah. Wait for one or two seconds and then place it on the nails. But don't wait for like five or six, seven to eight seconds like we used to do in the winter. You get what I'm trying to say? Because in the winter, yeah, okay, it takes a little longer. But in the summer, no, it's super fast, y'all. Super fast. So, yeah, I, I would just, me, I would just go with small. If I notice that it's drying up super fast on me, y'all. I will go with small beads at a time and apply it onto the nails and work my way like that with smaller beads here and there, here and there, like that. Now, that, that's because I work slow, y'all. I work slow, so that's why I'm doing like that. But if you work fast, if you work fast with acrylic, then hey, so be it. Then listen, you could go ahead with bigger beads and big beads, then hey, do you, because you're working fast with it. So you have enough time to maneuver the acrylic. You know, if that makes sense. But like if you're learning and if you slow, then I wouldn't recommend to go in with bigger beads. I would recommend to go in with smaller beads so like that you can have enough time to maneuver the um, acrylic to your liking. right here y'all um with this glitter this glitter is beautiful y'all this freaking teal glitter is freaking beautiful it is called teal dreamy um the only thing that i don't like is the way i try to do the design on this nail with this acrylic <laughs> i should have just did it you see how i'm going like working sideways slant it i should have just left it like that just like going down slant it going down to the side just like that I should have never did that other, like that, <laughs> the way you, it's looking now. I should have never did it like that. Bringing the other, doing that little twirly look, um, design coming down the side, you know, down to the free edge of the nails. Like I should have never did that. What is it? Like that. Oh my God. Like that boomerang look. <laughs> if that's what it's called, I don't freaking know. But yeah. I should have just did it like coming down, slant it to the side or, you know, or not going straight across right there in the middle of the, you know, where the, where the ombre meets at or right. I should have just put the glitter like right there in the middle of the nails and that's it. Like I should have never spread it down to the free edge of the nails going like that or anything like that. Cause to me that should look fucking ugly. Well, anyway, while y'all watching me work and do these nails, I want to talk a little about the the quality of this video. Have y'all noticed the difference on the quality of this video, the clarity, the quality, however the fuck you call it? But do y'all notice the difference, y'all? Because if y'all do, guess what? I'm using a, Sam, a Samsung Galaxy S21 phone to record this video. Damn, my bad. Yes, I am. <laughs> oh man, listen, y'all. Um, Candy, close by Candy. Um, that's my girl, y'all. She's fucking like hilarious as shit. She is so fucking funny, down to earth, all that good stuff, y'all. I'm gonna link her YouTube channel in the description box below. So like that, y'all can go check her out for yourself. She, um, one day her video quality like changed dramatically, drastically. It like that shit like. <laughs> went from 50 to 100 real quick and i was like wow like what the hell you did to your video girl that should look good as shit that should look clear and she was telling me that you know 
her bestie, her her hubby is into visual and audio and all that good stuff. And he recommended her to use a Samsung phone and stuff like that. So she started to use a Samsung phone. He, well, they gifted her a Samsung phone and she started to use a Samsung phone for her videos. And I I seen the quality difference, y'all. I was like, that, that shit look better than my video. And I'm using a damn iPhone. So I went ahead and went and got she should have never freaking told me that i should have never asked her right in the first place because <laughs> now i went on a search for a freaking samsung phone and i went ahead and went and bought a fucking samsung phone just to record fucking videos y'all because i now i want the same quality that she got okay i want my videos to look as good as hers okay so my fucking ass went and got well, I got it, it was refurbished, but still, it still costed a lot of fucking money. So, um, I went to Sans, not online, Samsung, and I, and I went ahead and got a refurbished Samsung phone because I wasn't gonna pay a thousand dollars for a phone just to record, you know. So, I got a refurbished one. Um, so I recorded this video with it. This is the first video I recorded with the phone. Um, I don't like when I'm recording and I'm looking at the phone while I'm recording. I notice the difference y'all is fucking clear. It's banging and all that good stuff. But I want to know how it looks when, as soon as I post it onto YouTube. Like I want to see how it looks when I post it on YouTube. I want to see the quality of it when you, when I put it up. Um, but the only thing y'all I don't like about this phone and I'm putting this out there to see if anyone can help me, help me out with this or even you candy like ask your bestie hubby like what can I do to get extra storage on the phone if y'all know okay if y'all got Samsung Galaxy S21 if y'all got those phones y'all know that those phones only comes in like one uh, you know like 122 128 gigs 512 gigs and stuff like that but it don't have a sd memory card slot it, those phones do not come with the sd memory card slot for you to get extra storage yeah yo that's my only problem with this phone is that i don't know how to get extra storage on the phone okay you know how iPhones got iCloud? So like that you can have extra storage on your phone with iCloud. So I want to know if the Samsung Galaxy phone has that option too. I was thinking about Samsung Cloud. What is Samsung Cloud? Is that like iCloud? You get what I'm trying to say? I want to know if that's like iCloud. I want to know if I can get extra storage through Samsung Cloud. Since I can add a memory card onto the phone to get extra storage, how is there another way that I can do that? You get what I'm trying to say? Yeah, y'all, because this video, the reason why I'm talking about that, because in, in this video, y'all, you're not going to see it, it stopped recording, y'all, when I was encapsulating the nails. It stopped recording because I did not have enough storage, y'all. So I got so freaking mad. I was so fucking upset, y'all. Because, you know, I like to show y'all my filing and, you know, all that. All that shit. If I could put it in the video, I'm going to put it in the video. So, um, yeah. So, it stopped in the middle of me encapsulating. And I didn't have, you know, more room to keep recording. And in order for me to keep on recording, I had to, like, stop. Move the video to, like, my laptop. And stuff like that. So like that, I could have you know space on the camera. I mean, on the phone to keep recording. Mind you, I'm not gonna do that while I'm do, doing, especially if I'm doing something with nail. I'm not gonna stop and be like, hold up, let me remove this video to my laptop so I could come back and record. No, I'm not trying to do all that. You know, especially if, like I said, especially if I'm doing something with nail. I'm, I can't, I can't be doing that. Bad enough, I'm already taking longer shit doing their fucking nails, and then. Then doing that, so I'm going to take even fucking longer. So anyway, so that's my only issue with this phone, y'all. So if y'all have any advices or any suggestions of what to do to get extra storage on the phone so I don't have to, like, stop 
and transfer videos or photos over to something else just so I can get more storage. Is there a way where I can get extra storage onto the phone without me doing that? Because if y'all know about iPhones, because you know iPhones, y'all. Like, okay, my the iPhone I got, I can record. I can record for two hours on one video. And then my, that, that video is sitting on my phone. Then the next day, I could record for like another hour and a half. And that video is still sitting in my phone. And I can still record like that without moving any videos. You get what I'm trying to say? Like... Like, I don't have to delete any videos or photos for me to keep recording. You know, if that makes sense. So, that's why I wanted to know if Samsung Cloud is the same thing like iCloud for that reason. And, um, okay, I know about SD cards. I, okay, I bought an SD card and I bought a USB um, SD card reader, right? So, like that, I can transfer over whatever videos I have on the Samsung phone. To transfer it over to my laptop and that's fine but i don't need i don't want to okay that's good but i'm talking about like to have extra storage on the phone yeah y'all anyway the reason why i'm saying this is because um this phone doesn't have anything okay so i only recorded this video right and this video um took me about like two hours and 50 something minutes almost three hours and then i had like another video for like 40 something minutes and next thing you know it just stopped like i didn't have enough storage to continue to record yeah y'all like i feel as though like i could have had a couple videos in there or a couple photos still on the phone without having this problem you get what i'm trying to say it was only two videos on that phone and no like maybe like two photos and next thing you know i didn't have no storage so that's why i'm like bummed about it you know and that's the reason why this video ended up to be this way because it stopped recording, you know, of me in the middle of me doing these nails. So yeah, y'all, y'all ever have any suggestions, any advices of what to do to get extra storage on the phone? Please let me know in the comments down below because um, I do not want to trade this phone in. Like I want to stay with this phone because of the quality of the video. But if not, if I can't get extra storage on this phone, y'all. I think I'm gonna go back to the iPhone. If I could trade this phone in and get another iPhone just to record, then I'm gonna do that because you know, the iPhone, like I know how to work with the iPhone a little bit more, you know, I'm more familiar with the iPhone. But yeah, I mean, if I don't, yeah, I mean, listen, I would like to stay with the Galaxy phone. I would like to stay with the Galaxy phone, but if, if I can't get extra storage onto the phone for whatever reason, then I think I'm gonna go back to the iPhone, yeah, y'all. But, um, so anyway, um, thank you, Candy, for, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for putting me deep on the quality of the video because I am loving it. I am loving it, but please help me out if you know anything about this storage thing, y'all, because I do not want to give up this phone. I do not. Help me. Help me. <laughs> help me. Yeah, y'all, extra hubby. I mean, get your hubby. Extra messy hubby. Uh, what to do with storage. Oh, man. Yeah, y'all. So, anyway, continue um, me watching. I mean, continue me watching. Continue watching me work. <laughs> Finishing up these nails and all that good stuff. Stay to the end so you can see the outcome of this nail set. It came out pretty cute. I like it. So, yeah, and then, you know, let me know what you think. And let me know your thoughts about this nail set in the comments down below, okay? If you like in the way this nail set is already coming out, y'all, go over right now and hit that like button for me. Stop what you're doing, right? And go and hit that like button for me really, really quick. Really, 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 really quick if you like the way this nail set is coming out so far. <laughs> and hit that subscribe button really, really quick. Real quick, okay? Hit that subscribe button for me too if you have not did so yet. <laughs> and these alarms keep going off. If it ain't the freaking alarm, it's the damn ring doorbell. Someone at the front door always fucking up somebody's voiceovers, yo, for real. All right, y'all, enough talking. I talked through this whole damn video. I freaking talked through this whole damn video. Anyway, after this, y'all, all I'm going to do is encapsulate all the nails with clear acrylic. And I will be using the clear acrylic from Glitter Planet. Is crystal crystal clear y'all this clear acrylic is pretty pretty clear y'all I am loving this clear so far anyways talking about clear acrylics my girl Nelly she's doing a video 
comparing clear acrylics y'all to see which one is the clearest acrylic of them all i don't know which brand she's she's swatching y'all i don't know which brand she is swatching but she will be swatching some clear acrylics to see which one is the clearest of them all to me so far i think is neat um nail mate from glitter planet and i gel beauty to me i think those two are the clearest by so far um so yeah y'all can't wait to see which one she thinks or who i can't wait to see you see what i mean you see what i mean well anyways like i was saying um <laughs> i'm telling you yo it never fails look at that look at that now they want to be messing with a fucking car now well anyways nelly is going to be really really let's try this again before i get pissed the fuck off anyway she is going to be swatching clear acrylics from different brands y'all so stay tuned for that video um if you have not subscribed to nelly um yet i'm gonna leave her youtube channel in in my description box um, I'm gonna leave her YouTube channel link in my description box so like that y'all can just click on that link and head over to the channel and don't forget y'all hit that subscribe button for her too and make sure you put the post notifications on so that you get notified for when she upload that video all right so like that y'all won't miss out on which one is the clearest acrylic <laughs> all right yeah and I'm also gonna leave Candy's channel in the description box below too so like that y'all can check out her videos too to see the quality of her videos because her video quality is freaking banging and i'm loving it you know so anyway with that being said y'all um 